Hey guys, my name is Vishal and today we're going to talk about why you should not turn off your Apple computer every single night. We're going to talk about why this is even an issue, like come on, it's 2021 guys, why can't we have the freedom to turn off or not turn off our laptops and why is it an issue? Well, we're going to go over that. We're also going to go over when and why you should shut your, down your Apple computer. We're going to go over why the reasons are that you should not shut down your Apple computer. And I'm going to give you guys my experience about using the M1 MacBook Pro and tell you guys about how uh, or what my habits are for turning off uh, and putting this computer to sleep to maintain good health. So is turning off your Apple computer actually a concern? Well, I would say in some cases, yes, because there's a lot of activities that your, computer, that your Apple computer does while it's asleep and not shut down. Things like checking for software updates, checking your applications for uh, updates of their own, uh, like mail, for instance, uh, and also backing up uh, files and releasing memory. Right. So those are things that are happening in the background when it's asleep and not shut down. Now Apple calls that power nap, and it's something that happens in all Apple computers. So what happens if you uh, if you do shut it down? Well, if you do shut down your computer. Uh, it can't actually do any of these activities that it needs to do while it's asleep. And the only time that it can do those activities is when you restart it or turn it on, uh, maybe, maybe in, in the morning when you first turn on your computer. Well, at that point then you want to start using your computer, but it's running these updates in the background, it's checking for updates, it's using some resources. Uh, to be able to update your apps, to update your computer, and to back up files. And this is using a lot, of the, a lot of the resources of the computer, slowing down your experience overall. And so that is the main reason that you don't actually want to turn off your Apple computer every single night. Um, because if you do, then every morning you're waking up and you're turning on your computer and you have a slow experience from the start. Now that's a pretty good reason about why you shouldn't turn off your computer every single night. But I know some of you guys are going to be saying, hey, you know, Michelle, what, what about battery life? You know, what about, like, it's using a lot of resources, using the battery, the battery's draining overnight, so if I shut it down, my laptop will have, uh, you know, it will last a little bit longer. Now, from my experience, what I've seen is the degradation overnight for, for, your, for your laptop is, is not very high. It's maybe 1%, 2%. And considering that these laptops take like an hour to charge, I think it's you know more than you know sufficient. I think it's it, it, it's a pretty good case to just leave your uh, even your laptops on. Yes, they will be draining battery, but like I said, slightly. And if it's one or two percent every night, you so you can still last for. If you just had it on on sleep, you could probably last a couple of weeks without ever having to turn it on. But that's not what you're going to do, right? You're going to turn it on, you're going to do some do other activities with it, and those will take up a lot more of the battery than just leaving it on overnight or leaving it asleep overnight. And the other thing you guys might say is, well, what about just the power usage? Like you're you're wasting the battery, you're you're using up a lot more power than you should be. You are, you know, it's bad for the environment, that kind of stuff. Well, I agree with you guys on that. It is going to take more power. It's going to take uh, more, uh, or eat more of the battery and you're going to have to charge it more often. And yes, it's going to be worse off for the environment if you leave your computer on every single night. That is absolutely one of the concerns about this. But it, it's really up to you. It depends on, on how you operate and how you work. If in the morning you can turn on your computer and let it sit there for half an hour doing those updates, all that kind of stuff, and then get started on it, that's absolutely fine and you guys can absolutely do that. But if you're someone that really needs to be able to pick up your laptop, turn it on and get right to work, it might not be the best for you. So it is going to be case dependent and I think that you guys can decide for yourselves which is best for you. And speaking of personal preference, um, like I said, I want to tell you guys about my experience of using my MacBook Pro. And I think I have restarted my laptop um, once over the last three months and the performance has been absolutely fine. It, there hasn't been really much degradation. The only reason I actually re uh, turned my computer off or shut it down was because of a software update and it needed to update and needed to shut down and then restart. So it did that and then I was pretty happy with it. I got back into, um, 
into using it. And again, I haven't shut it down since the software update. And I don't plan really on shutting it down uh, until there's a, you know, a need to shut it down uh, in the future here. All right guys, that's it for today. I, w I just wanna say thank you guys so much for watching and tuning in to this video. Uh, I wanna say if you guys did learn something about the M1 Rock Pro, about uh, putting it to sleep versus shutting it down, please let me know down in the comment section below. If you liked the video, hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. Thanks again and I will see you guys in the next video.